booty, show me the booty, give me the booty, I want the booty, back up the booty, I need the booty, I like the booty, oh what a booty, shaking that booty, I saw the booty, I want the booty, Lord what a booty. The mother was awoken by the rage of the spirits of the undead. Those denied passage to the underworld with the death of the water dragon. She feeds on their anger, their hatred, their dark side point. <laughs> this voice is starting to hurt my throat. I hope she doesn't talk much longer. Oh, for fuck's sake. Her dark power has twisted the infolk into monsters that crave the flesh of humans. Zombie, I mean cannibals. How can I know you're not lying? The people in the inn looked human to me. Illusion. The mother is powerful and she had taught some of her magic to her children. Far more intelligent than his brethren. The keeper has woven spells to confuse the eye. Think a moment about the inn. How have they been surviving? Why did they not flee? Why did the ghosts not attack them? Because they ain't afraid of no ghosts. Finally, look to the demons that attack my home. Were I behind this all? Would I laid siege on my own domain? Surely the picture cannot paint itself more fully for you. Well, what if the picture's a really shitty artist? So why am I'm not even going to bother asking that. Where did this demon come from? She has been here for longer than your empire, human. This forest has held two spirits for longer than history can remember. Well, history has a pretty shitty memory. It is the way of my kind. You mean the furries? When we are tied to your world as I am tied to the forest, there is a dark side. <laughs> dark side. To match the light. <laughs> Star Wars. Usually one side will be dominant, but even in broad daylight there are shadows. Well, a fucking course. Oh, well, whatever. So why am I imp so important? You know the water dragon is missing, and that your world feels with the spirits of the undead, but this forest has illustrated what that really means. I had to burp. The mother's awakening and her spreading corruption is just a beginning. One of many that will happen all over your empire. You do not want to see the end. Yeah, we'll never see the end of this game, because I never update. hi yo, <laughs> Making fun of myself. You must restore the water dragon. Since you went to my forest spirit monk, I have felt your presence. I have felt the essence of your mistress. Dawnstar? <laughs> the water dragon's touch is upon you, and it is recent. I've been having visions of a spirit in blue. Could that be her? A woman in blue? She would often appear in such a guise, yes. The form of a celestial dragon can be intimidating, especially... What's happening right now? Because you're totally getting it. I'll just I'll wait for you to get done. Yeah. You. Even here, so weak. The waters cannot bleed forever. Water can't bleed at all. Nothing is without end. Not even this world. Not when my power rests in the hands of mortals. Oh, and what is that supposed to mean? Well, go find a god to do your dirty work, you ungrateful bitch. Are you the spirit of the water dragon? Names are fleeting. Oh, Given God, so your cryptic kind whore. can point and say, that is mine. All words, names, history, dreams, they die on your lips. Or it could be so we can point and say that's what that is. What remains after that is beyond yeah. you, or is meant to be. Not everything can be owned, not without price. You will pay a debt Do owned I? by another. Oh, cool. I lack the strength to help you. You cannot avoid your fate. When someone steps beyond their station, others must fall to fill the gap. And I'm back. Sorry about that. My dad came in. Um. Someone has challenged the gods? Challenged you? He challenges the order. He pushes above while you are where you should be. Where you must be. Know your place, mortal. If you fail in your destiny, your true enemy falls with you. And if he falls, so do we all. 
You must win. But in doing so, you will lose. Cryptic whore. It is a painful circle that must be allowed to close. You do not truly have a choice until you confront what comes after. You will be free to act, but there is a cost. So I should start saving up silver? And she leaves. I fucking hate that bitch. She is still alive, but in great pain. I knew it. Dead gods grant no miracles, and no emperor can summon endless water. You are the one the water dragon has chosen to restore the balanced spirit, monk. Your mistress calls on you. <laughs> I'll bring the Vaseline in the Trojan. What? Now that I am sure of your role in things, it is all the more vital you choose which fork in the road you will take. Can I choose a fork off the table? Forks in the road will be dirty. Why me? Why doesn't she ask you for help? Uh, no, no, I'm picking this. Can you explain anything the water dragon said? She speaks in riddles. I cannot see or hear her, human. Only you seem close enough to pick the whispers from the air. All I could catch was a scent, but it was one I knew well. I know what uh, what you must do now. I'm slurring my speech because I'm just standing here bobbing my head back and forth until you press X. Press X, motherfucker. You need to make your way to the Imperial City. Ooh, will a guard come up there and be all like, Stop right there, criminal scum. You've... You've broken the law. Pay the court a fine, or and your stolen gourds are off at them like resistor red. Then he's all, pay it with your blood. And I know, Lord, blah, 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 blah. And so, the choice. Will you attempt to destroy me and tell Yana was behind the corruption of this land? Or will you brave the more dangerous road and face the mother? I've already made my decision. I'm all ears, human. <laughs> Literally, her ears are fucking massive. Yeah, Mimi? Back again. The mother must be destroyed. How can I find her? There are caves beneath the pilgrim's rest. They are infested with, ca with zombie cannibals, and the creatures work tirelessly to free their mistress. For all their digging, they cannot be completely free her until I am destroyed, or until I release her, and that is exactly what I plan to do. You must go to the Pilgrim's Rest. I will release the seal on the door beneath the inn so that you may enter her lair and confront the Shrine of the Silver Monkey. What will I... That's all I need to know to face her. Once the seal is broken, I will not be able to close it again. You must not fail. I'm the protagonist, like I ever fail. You will find a way to defeat the mother, and you will survive. I will survive! I don't know the song! You must. I will find the you after she is dead. I will make my, my way to the inn immediately. Shall I send you back to the, to the portal to my temple, or would you prefer to walk among these islands a bit longer? I will walk. Breathe deeply. You will find yourself in other places where the air is less pure soon enough. Right, I chose to walk because I saw some loots over here in this ceramic urn. Is that supposed to be trapped or something? Huh, weird. And we get to read this scroll. Read that if you want to. Probably some more shit around here. Uh, let's go into this. We go towards the light. Oh god, it burns! Ah! Ah, god! Ah! Oh wait, no, I'm fine. Wait, are there really some more demons down there? Oh, fuck it, I won't teleport me back. I shall go deal with the in Yeah, send me back to the portal. Time is of the essence. Go safely. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this magical portal with you. How do I take a portal with me? Don't question it. I'm a fox god. Where's Black Whirlwind? Oh, he's probably fighting those things. Oh, well. He's he's a big boy. He can handle himself. Hey, look. He jumped right into the loading screen. Hey, you Black Whirlwind. I will murder you for leaving me with those fairies. You mad, bro? Yes, I'm getting mad. Get some focusy stuff going on right here. Did we read this already? I don't know. We probably did. Either way, let's go. Yeah, let's do it. I'll meet you guys back there. Now, we head to our destiny. 
Oh, sorry, I'm sniffing so much. I, I hate it when I do that. It's just I have allergies kind of badly. No, no, you have sided with the spirit. We have thought her dead, but her stink is on you. Oh my god, I keep telling people it's Black Whirlwind. You do not know our true nature. You know nothing of the power we possess. Look upon us now and see your doom. I'll probably just see a bunch of fugly little midget rat creature demon things. And I was right! Gaze upon our forms and bask in our glory. <laughs> you should be honored to see the true strength of the cannibal. <laughs> Zombies. Yeah, I... Didn't see that coming. <laughs> if they're as aggressive as they are ugly, then this will get bloody fast. The faster, the better. <laughs> I love you, Black Whirlwind. This is what you have turned away from? Ew. For what? Fox? Well, the Fox does look slightly more Terrence pleasant than you pieces. people do. We will feast tonight on those succulent flanks. Ew. Oh, you mother fucking cunt. Come here, you cunt licking bitch. Oh, wait, no, cunt licker is a good thing. I'm gonna switch to my sword because I'm cheap like that. I'm gonna jump over you because I'm even cheaper like that. Yeah, he has a uh, ice shard, which I thought. I think he's actually the only cannibal that has a um style that's like not part of the cannibal style. Oh, this is gonna be cool. This is gonna be so ace. Oh yeah, I got like six of them for like an actual, for like a combo for like a like a um, monster kill. Why did I switch to monkey paw? I didn't mean to switch to monkey paw. I'll probably end up benefiting more than it'll hurt me though. Yeah, woohoo! Punch you a bunch of times, because this is cheap as fuck. It's doing almost as much damage as a longsword, but no, like, focus cost or whatever. Oh, that, that probably should have taken more health away from you. I call hacks. Stop blocking, you fucking cheap son of a cunt! And die in hell. Spartans! Tonight we block... Oh, wow, the... Power attack for the monkey thing doesn't do much damage, it seems. Oh, fuck you and your blocking this. Thanks, Black Whirlwind. You're awesome, buddy. I love you. Oh, fuck more of them. <laughs> He's just like, no, don't hurt me. Right, we're gonna karate kick the shit out of them with our chi enhanced attacks and heal a bit because I'm, no, I'm not really low on health, but I'm in an uncomfortable zone. My god, how many of them are you? I'm gonna get a harmonic combo on one of you. Whoosh! Oh, 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 we didn't get it. We'll get one on the other. Soon. Just front cartwheel in front of you. In fact, we got one on this one. Come on, come on, come on. Yes. Oh, and he's even blocking. What a retard. Then he explodes in a puddle of gore. This is why this game was rated M, because of that pile of red paint. I mean ketchup. I mean the blood of our enemies that we're going to bathe in later, because Black Whirlwind just smacked the fuck out of this one. Then he taunted it by teabagging it with his axe. Astonishing. I haven't seen such martial skills in an eatery since the last time I added ginger to my wife's hot and sour soup. <laughs> Thank you for your great kindness in rescuing me. Now that these beasts are dead, I can finally talk to you. Yeah, I remember you were kind of acting my funny. My name is Henpeck Ho, and before you ask, I'm not one of those monsters. They kept me prisoner so that I could seem normal to the customer. You seemed even weirder than they did, buddy. Err. I'm Ryu, the dragon. No sense dancing around it. You might as well have asked. <laughs> My wife is unique. To say that she is as enduring as the wall itself is to do a disservice to her persistence. <laughs> Bet I could kick her ass. I could make similar comparisons between the force of her will and the Imperial Army, but I think you have the picture. No, I don't. Black Whirlwind stole it. I sold it for some wine! Why don't you just leave her? You have no idea what you're suggesting. I'm suggesting you leave your wife. <laughs> I saw of her, she was in the Imperial City. I was due back more than a week ago, and if she hasn't torn the place down looking for me, I'll be surprised. <laughs> I love you, dude. That's beside the point for now. I must thank you, as I clearly owe you my life. Hell yeah, you do. But I'll accept payment in bagels. The were getting desperate enough to cook even someone as ropey as me. Wow. The last thing I needed was to be dragged into the caves below. <laughs> Yeah, you probably would. You'd look like this guy I know in real life. Really skinny dude with freckles and red hair. <laughs> he better be glad he went to a private school. He would have got crushed. They're a cave. Why did they keep you around? What were they planning? Good cop, bad cop. Black Whirlwind, you be good cop. Huh? They spoke often about the mother in the caves nearby. 
They used this inn as a base and a way to lure people to increase their food stocks and swell their ranks. Makes sense. So. What they failed to realize is that the forest is polluted with ghosts. No travelers means no food, whether people think this place is normal or not. Maybe they had some plan around that, but I doubt it. They are not forward thinkers, these beasts. <laughs> How it all ties together, I'm not exactly sure. With a knot. Like, you should not eat people. It's wrong. I love how Black War went back in the background just staring in his face like, I wonder if I made a break for it, I could get some wine before these two finish talking. I'm not that fast, but the conversation in this game seemed to go on for quite a while. And what are you doing, Black World? I'm nothing. Tell me about these caves. I heard a lot about the caves from the cannibal. There's something down there they call the Mother, and I think she... it. Whatever. Is what made them what they are. Hmm. How do they reach the caves below? That is something I do not know. They would leave the inn and then return. I wasn't in a position to ask for details. No, you were in a selling position. You just bought and sold stuff. That's enough about the caves. Is there anything else that I can help you with? Not at all, friend. Why did they keep you around, or what were your captors? Well, they're cannibals. Zombies. They were once men, but they were corrupted. Zombies. Twisted into flesh-eating abominations. Zombies! How did they disguise themselves? The Keeper, the one who met everyone, including yourself, at the door, had some skill with magic. Yeah, obviously, he was pounding me with ice you shard. Seen through the illusion in time, but most people never get the chance. They're usually taken, or worse, changed into one of them. How is that worse? Where do they come from? They claim that they were changed by a creature called the Mother in the caves below. Okay, none of this is important, so I'm skipping by. We should discuss something else. I know all I want to know about these cannibals. Wish I would have picked this one earlier. You killed the cannibals up here, but there's more in the caves below. Hey, he's got a mole. I don't know how they got in or out, or how they took prisoners down there. Probably grabbed them. 